Okay, we just came out of the shitty pond. Shitty pond. Last sale trade. Last sale trade. Last time we were here was with 64-bit Matthew. Yes, we really sir. need to do a freaking boys' night out again. Yes, we do. The people have been asking, Matt. The people have been asking. So, uh, yeah, just came out of City Pond. I thought we did okay. I no think bad. Ian got by the day right now. Exactly. So far. What up, YouTube? Nate here. Master Ian. And we're back with another episode of The Ian Show. We ain't counting no more. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Uh, well, we went to a few places today, so some of those pickups are going to be in there. Yeah. Uh, some eBay grab, good stuff, cheap imports. That's going to be on I the like menu. This maple syrup is delicious. <laughs> <laughs> Get ready, fighters! Yeah, I'm going to start with, I think, I got these four Super Nintendo games in like, just a small bundle. Shelf padding? Yeah. Shelf padding round it, one. It's shelf padding. Donkey Kong Country. It's a double for trade now. Super Mario Kart. SimCity, which I had a copy that I got at a pawn shop that didn't work. And now I have one that works. Oh, he put on the Duke I put on the Duke oh, chain. I run this. Okay. King Kong ain't got shit on me! <laughs> Pawn shop finds from today. As soon as I saw that, I'm like, oh. Did you like how I tried to get discounts? I'm like, hey, are you new here? <laughs> <laughs> I ended up taking most of the junk. <laughs> that junk? Just cause, but. It's I less got, than $5 a cartridge. Yeah. That's it was, garage it was like, sale. It was like two bucks a cartridge or something. I think we'll save that for a pickup video, but. Yeah. Bunch of just <laughs> random mess. <laughs> Not of many S games, the guy just really wanted them gone. I think they've been in that pawn shop. Yeah, forever. we probably could have got a better deal, honestly. Yeah, but the, I I got a decent deal. I think it came to well, what, two bucks each? Yeah, two bucks a game maybe. Yeah. So Bang this cran, shelf oh, yeah, this is all shelf padding. <laughs> uh Fisher Price, <laughs> perfect fit. I think we were saying because ignorant Lester can't read. Yeah, <laughs> even with that. I can read. <laughs> Probably the well, next Super game. Glove Ball. I've never played that. Power Glove and Joystick Compatible. Ooh. Double Dare. <laughs> that looks just as good as Anticipation. <laughs> yeah. Uh, T2. Terminator 2. Judgment Day. What is this one? Vindicators. Vindicators. Tengen. Tengen Cart. And uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. That's nice. a double I got complete already. I'll probably Love trade that, that away. By the way. Underrated side scroller. A lot it of people is. didn't like this one. It was, it was too hard. It was too hard. Get out of my teeth. Just... Satisfaction Jeez. of like getting through that game. Exactly. Is worth you know what's funny? Because at the ending, if you people didn't get to the end, you get a giant technodrome, and the turtle's like the size of half the technodrome. <laughs> yeah. That's where you gotta save Donnie for the end. And you save Raph for the hard parts where you get injured a lot. Yeah. You know oh, use wow. Raph? Raph is just like the sacrificial lamb. Yeah. Like in the swimming he stage, yeah. that's where Raph gets fucking juice. Yeah. Baby Cran. Baby Cran. Keep going. Okay. Alright. Are we waiting for you or we're just continue? Screw okay. this. This is the Ian Baby's show. Cran. Baby's Cran. Nate's Nate's gone. gone. We don't need his ass okay. here. We are on to No Cheaps, round no two. Cheaps. Ding, ding, ding. Go! Uh, same phone shop where we got those NES games. Dick Tracy in box. I already have this game, but I didn't have the box. So that's in there. <laughs> and Secret Files, Tunguska, and Dead Space Extraction for the Wii. Is that how you pronounce it? Tunguska? Tunguska. Tunguska! Tunguska. Finish all these! Tunguska. Tunguska. <laughs> Tunguska. Space and Dead Space Extraction. This game is actually sealed, but like they, I think they cut the price <laughs> <Yeah>. out. <laughs> but just it is ruined factory the factory sealed. sealed. <laughs> Might as well just rip it off. I'll open that one. Mm -hmm. I want to play it. And yeah, Dead Space Extraction. That's a super fun, it's like arcade shooter style game. And a different pawn shop, uh, Shitty Pawn. That's the trade. trade. <laughs> uh, trauma Center New Blood. It will be my first Trauma Center game. Tell me if anyone else had problems trying to beat this game because of the Wii motion. It's called, like, it's not accurate. You have to do special the motion plus. Plus. That's the thing, I never played it with the Motion Plus. So maybe it's better. Who knows? Let us know. I'm looking forward to playing this game. Atlas. Theme of Nate's last video. Four and Atlas gonna be. <laughs> They're really nice at the pawn shops today, to be honest. Yeah, they're just way so better than thrift them. stores right now. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Some of these are kind of cheap, but because I didn't have them and they're from my GameCube collection that I'm trying to complete, they're going to be in no cheaps. This was at the flea market. Flea market, yes. Yeah. Got a sweet deal on all these. Uh, Egg Mania, Extreme Madness. Egg Extreme Madness. Looks stupid. Pool Paradise. Looks stupid. Because you play wow. pool. <laughs> you know they had the dookie chain. Hey, hey, hey. Defender. 
That was pretty cool. And it's like a modernized version of, Defender. I guess, the original <laughs> arcade. It was an arcade, right? Defender? Yep. Yeah. And 13. Uh, case a little dirty, I'll clean all that up. But I really enjoyed this game. I had it on Xbox. Now, I'm wondering, is there a company, if anyone knows on the internet, because Ian's trying to go for the complete collection, I'm pretty sure one day he'll probably want nice clean boxes for them. Is there a company that actually makes them exactly? Oh, like the GameCube, the actual the mini disc cases. The mini disc cases, right? Like, that is actually a good question. See, that's something Lester would be very anal oh, about. I'm I very, probably wouldn't. I'm care. not super I go anal about that. Like, as long as I could put them in a the custom case or whatever. Like right now, I think I'm just gonna go for title. I obviously want to get as many original cases and like manuals as I can, but it's not a, a big thing for me. Also from the same flea market, continuing on with my NES collection box games, I got Arkista's Ring. Uh, I don't know anything about this game, but I did oh, see someone trying to sell it a while ago on one of these pages that were part of, and it looked interesting to me, so I got that one. Uh, next one, Double Dragon 2. Now the one I got, this isn't actually the, the one I got from the flea market. I put that one into my collection because it was a box upgrade. So now I have a, an extra Double Dragon with box for sale. Okay, one, two, and three. Which is the best Double Dragon? Two. Oh, I like the first one a lot. Me too, personally. Yeah. I don't. I can, for two player action, you play part two. Yeah, that's the reason yeah. that like I yeah. played the shit out of this yeah. game with like my brother or my friend, yeah. whoever was with me at the time. I played this the most, and because it was two player, I was on. Yeah. My baby got one sock and one no sock. <laughs> Be right back. I'm gonna call it big as small. I guess we hey. can go to. <laughs> the dookie chain's on. <laughs> you Should bless this with hate. This or just do it right now? You bless this with hate. He's gone again, Kranz. He's, <laughs> he's not. Nate's not good enough to be in the maple oh, syrup. So no, uh, he's cut from the maple syrup so in this cut. video. Pickles. I mentioned some imports, eBay. Imports are a lot cheaper than trying to get games here. So uh, and there's a lot so of great good. exclusives that you can get imported. And the prices are a lot cheaper, like infinitely cheaper. I'm very really. hesitant to say this on YouTube. Uh, all all the games that. from me. Actually, we can cut But we're going to know. We'll say it. We'll say it because <laughs> we're thrift Yeah. Yeah. Um, you know, Ian's ordering stuff. I started eating stuff from yeah. Japan now. And you know what? The, they're, oh, they're cheap. They're really inexpensive. A lot of... A lot of people in Japan will do free shipping as well, and they keep their their stuff in really, clean. really good condition, clean. So the You're first one, uh, I already have this. I ordered it like a few years ago, but this one came in a uh, bundle. The, the bundle, the game that it came with, I'm gonna announce as the last one as my maple syrup, maple syrup. But these are all maple syrup to me. But this one is Chrono Trigger, the one I'm talking about now. I have this already, but this came with one of the other games. So I got a really good deal on both. I guess if you wanted to put a price on the, the both of them, I'd say it was 17 bucks each. Complete, complete with manuals. You gotta love and the cover. Excellent condition. And the artwork. Yeah, it's beautiful. Come on. I hate you, Ian. <laughs> this one means a lot to me. and It's um, Paneled Upon, which in North America is known as Tetris Attack. This game is crack. It is crack. We all play it together. I got all these guys addicted to this game. And I just, I wanted the original, came in box two. I think this one was 15 bucks as well. Uh, 10 to 15 bucks. It's, might have been 12 bucks. I can't remember. But either way, in box manual. And I'm happy to have that one. I'm coming for your ass. <laughs> okay. I'm training hard, man. <laughs> the last one, uh, this is the one I got paired with Chrono Sugar. So it came to, there's 17 bucks each I, I have in that. And that is Bahamut Lagoon. Uh, this is one we didn't get in North America, and uh, I've always wanted to play it. Yeah. I have a Retron 5 now, and I believe you can download uh, translation patches and put them on the SD card for, in, for your Retron 5, and it will patch the game with the English language when you load it up. So this is my maple syrup, and I can't wait to play it. I can't wait either. The graphics look like Final Fantasy 6. It's, it's a Squaresoft yeah. game. It's an, yeah, it's and it looks like yeah FF6 pretty much, which I also have. <laughs> yeah, that's awesome. And, like beautiful. This one's absolutely mint. But that's it for my yeah. new Ian Show pickup. Let me know what you think. What do you think about importing games? I know it's becoming more popular because it's cheaper. Kind of rambling on. Yeah, we are rambling. I was gonna say. <laughs> <laughs> so, It'll be my headbutt coffee. I'll make a headbutt. Coffee. Yeah, it is his headbutt coffee here. So, I guess we are done. This is the last Ian Show 
for season Some three. Season. We're gonna do another video soon. I don't know. Whenever Nate's <laughs> ready. But anyway, Lester. Ian. Nate. Nate. Remember to visit the hottest internet website on the internet today, facebook.com slash thriftweller. Say hi. Read comment. Read comments. Troll. Troll. Derp. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, and see you. Peace. <laughs>See, that's the thing though, people can import them here and then try to resell them because people don't know any better type yeah. thing. So yeah, there's there's gonna be people ripping you off locally or wherever yeah. you live, right? Do not pay more than thirty dollars for this complete online. Like that's the most that this goes for online right now. This one I was able to get, like I said, for two for thirty five, so seventeen bucks each. You know what? Uh, listen to that inner thrift dweller inside you when you're looking at these yeah. games. Always look for the better deals. Don't jump on things right away just because you know you might be desperate or something. Especially from Japan, there's always new postings going up and awesome prices.